गुड मॉर्निंग बेटा गुड गुड मॉर्निंग मैम मॉर्निंग मैम गुड मॉर्निंग गुड मॉर्निंग वंस अगेन इट इज सो कोल्ड इज इट आर यू फीलिंग कोल्ड चिल्ड्रन गुड मॉर्निंग मैम गुड मॉर्निंग आर यू फीलिंग कोल्ड यस मैम टू मच too much it's too cold but still we should be very thankful that we are in the house in our houses and taking classes yes yes ma'am otherwise it, in school it would have been like freezing Your yes ma'am and the sun is coming through the window yes it is so open we are comfortably taking classes from home so nice Yes, ma'am. Finally, where are all students? They have not completed. They have not finished their breakfast. I think they are still eating. Ma'am, they are just chilling. Yes. They are slow eaters. Like in school, also in the recess time, not everyone is able to complete to finish the tiffin. You know, so these children have not. And ma'am, I complete. Ma'am, I have done my breakfast and played till five minutes. Oh, so you're a fast eater. And in five minutes, and in five minutes, I kept my book. Very, very good. Very nicely organized. What did you eat for breakfast? Ma'am, uh, bread and a butter. Bread and butter. And milk. Good. Very nice. healthy breakfast what about others others are not interested in opening cameras and others are not interested in talking hmm? all of you are sitting with your cameras closed do you miss miss those days of sharing tiffins with each other i remember this girl gang so zoya samya nandini Aradhya, all of you used to yeah. up and have your tiffins. Yes, Zoya. Yes, ma'am. On yes. Ma'am on one bench, three girls. Yes. So a group of six used to have Good their morning, lunch together. Ma Good morning, beta. Good morning. Okay. Zoya, Athar, Mishti, open your cameras and take out your creative writing copies. Today we are going to do a new topic. Okay, ma'am. Good morning, ma'am. Good morning. Today's topic is diary entry. Now, have you heard that people write diaries? people write about their events and all ma'am what if we have done only one paragraph on the topic speech writing you have done just one paragraph no children have yes, completed their speech have you not completed the speech till now ma'am i have completed my speech one paragraph uh, that is topic teachers day Yes, it was Teachers Day given to you. So, children, have you not completed speech writing? Tell me. Ma'am, I have completed. Ma'am, please give the topic on the speech writing on children's day, please, ma'am. No, listen. First of yes. all, yes. Uh, I want the answer to my question. Have you all completed speech writing the Teachers Day topic that I gave you? Yes, yes, ma'am. Ma Okay, raise your hands. Those who have completed, Mishti has done. What about you, Anmol, Pratyaksh, Athar has done. And my little bit is left. Why, beta? Why it is left? Why didn't you complete it? Now we are having this class after so many days. Yes, you should have. Ma'am, because the period will get over. the period got over pratyak what ma'am have you completed speech writing yes ma'am 
ओके अनमोल बेटा नाउ यू विल डू इट लेटर ठीक है एवरी वन एल्स हैज डन लेट स्टार्ट विद न्यू टॉपिक टूडे दैट इज डायरी एंट्री नाउ पीपल हैव हैबिट ऑफ राइटिंग डायरीज सपोज दे सब देर आर पीपल हु यस प्रत्यक्ष आई कॉन्ट हेयर यू यस and we have only done the one speech writing yes we have only done one topic of speech writing that is teachers day now everybody just mute yourself ma'am see i have changed my paragraph of okay, teacher beta. day okay good now everybody just mute yourself and listen to me for two minutes we are going to do par we are going to do the topic for uh, one topic for every uh, this thing uh the topics that are coming in your syllabus what are they they are diary entry unseen passage that is comprehension speech writing and one more what is the fourth thing that is coming uh formal Man, paragraph letter. writing no formal letter formal. not paragraph writing yes ma'am formal letter so we have done one formal letter we have done one speech writing we have done unseen passages yes today we are going to do the diary entry the fourth topic left okay then we are going to revise everything one by one once again we have covered all three topics now only diary entry is left now what is a diary entry diary entry is writing down a diary and writing your events or a particular day that you spent uh, on a special like if it is special or even if it is not a special day there are people who write down diaries on daily basis they sit at night and write down the entire days event the entire schedule the entire days schedule that they have how they have passed their day what all happened in a particular day yes there are people who do this so in a diary entry when you write you have to take care of two three things very importantly firstly a diary entry is written in past tense <clears throat> why it is written in past tense because we are writing down something that has already taken place okay then it is written in first person that is i i went to the market i felt this thing i found this thing in my home it is always written in first person because you are writing what you did you will not write she did that and she did this yes you can include that i went to a i went to a shop and i find found a woman who was feeling very depressed you can discuss you can describe whatever you felt is that fine so today we are acha there is also a particular format of a diary entry what is that format the format goes on the top you are supposed to write the date and the day on which you are writing a diary suppose i am writing my diary today so i will write the day monday and 31st of january okay that is how i am supposed to write then under it i am going to write the time the time is 11:30 right now i am going to write 11:30 i am writing this whatever you'll just write the time 11:30 and then how you begin writing you have to write the greeting the greeting is dear diary we generally start by writing dear diary because you're writing it to the diary okay you're writing it to the diary so we'll write dear diary my, today my day no sorry not today yesterday or maybe if you're writing at the night time so you'll write i had a wonderful day today or it was a very bad day today maybe you experienced something bad if it was a good thing you experienced something good it was a wonderful day if you are particularly writing about any event say suppose i'll give you a topic right now and you have to describe how your journey or how your visit to a particular place went so this is how you write and what kind of language you use you use informal language okay it is not that respected and this and that honorable we don't use words like these 
Dear diary, today I'm going to write about my birthday, how my birthday went, like that. Okay, this is how you write. Then in the end, when you finish writing, you just give your signature on the left hand side. That's all. Just your signature, just your name, not even full name, not even your surname. I'll write everything in my diary and then in the end, I'll write Neha. That's it. Okay, I'm going to put my signature. So everybody now ready with your, be ready with your copies. I'm giving you a topic. Yes, Pratyaksh, why are you raising hand? Ma'am, we have to do signature at the last or just write the name? Write your name. Write your name. Okay, what is the spelling of diary? Yes. Don't write a dairy entry. Okay. Otherwise, all cows and buffaloes will, will come in. They will enter it. It's diary. It's not dairy. Okay. Your topic now, see. Excuse me, ma'am. Yes. Ma'am, like I have written diary entry here. So can I write the topic here and start diary from here? Yes, wait, I just wait. I'm getting a call from school. Just wait. Hello? I cannot understand that what I have to write in the starting point when I am writing a paragraph. So, ma'am, I cannot Peter, understand. Hold a little patience. Keep little patience. Let me complete the question first. Okay, I got a call from school. So, I just uh, the flow broke in between. Just give me a minute. I'm completing the question and I'll, I'll explain you how you will begin. Okay, ma'am.
Okay. See, you went to Nainital in this extreme winter season, okay? Or in this extreme winter, you saw snowfall for the first time. Write your experience in your diary in about 100 to 120 words using the clues given below. I will give you the clues below, some words that you are going to uh, include in your diary entry. How you will begin? You will begin by writing today's date, day and the time. Time you will write what the time is right now, 11.45. Okay, write that. And then start by writing dear diary, dear diary and it was a wonderful experience this time when I went to Nenital on and you have to give a particular date. Let's say you went to Nenital on 31st of December. Yes, extreme. it is extremely cold at that time. When I went to Nenital on 31st of December 2021, you have to mention the day, mention the date, mention the uh, time when you are talking about a particular event. Okay. And then you will say why it was wonderful, what all happened in that. And you have to write all the events as they took place. That is in a chronological order. First you went there, then you got down, then you entered your resort or your hotel. It was freezing cold like that. Okay. You uh, went into the room, you settled down and whatever, howsoever you want to write, you're going to write that. Okay, ma'am. Excuse me, ma'am. Yes. Ma'am, after date, we have to return dear write, diary and, and then we have to start writing. Yes, you have to start writing. Man, like this. Yes, Peter, yes. Perfect. Hills, mountains, hotel, resort or lodge, chilly winter air, it was freezing cold. And what else will you write? You had gloves, caps, then overcoats, then gloves, caps, overcoats. What else? Gum boots, yes. In the snow, what do you carry? Do you wear normal slippers, your Crocs, or you pack your? No, ma'am. We yes. use, ma'am. We use long shoes, gum boots. Gum boots, yes. Then hotels on. <laughs> there is a one train. Dumbstruck. Okay. Now let's listen to the word dumbstruck. What is dumbstruck? When you see something that is that your high, uh, that is very difficult to believe that your eyes cannot believe like snowfall is an experience in itself. Isn't it? Has anyone ever seen snowfall ever? Ma'am, I never seen snowfall. Yes, I have also never seen. So I'm sure when I'm going to see it is going to be a very wonderful sight before me. And I'll be dumbstruck, like I'll be speechless. I won't have anything to say. What a wonderful sight. It is going to be like that. So I was dumbstruck to see such a view before my eyes. A beautiful nature's gift. Yes, isn't it a nature's gift? Like, yes. Yes. Yes, but when we go into the man, man, front of the topic, we have to write this full. The, it, better you need not write these clues in your copy you can simply start writing but you can include these clues in your passage okay okay ma'am ma'am when i put i can't understand what you are saying ma'am when i put my hands into the snow so i 
feel anything. Yes, they become numb. कहते हैं हिंदी में भी से सुन पड़ गए हाथ है ना सुन नहीं पड़ जाती फिंगर मैम बट वॉट वी हैव टू राइट फ्रंट ऑफ इन इंग्लिश इट इज कॉल्ड बट वी हैव टू राइट फ्रंट ऑफ द टॉपिक फ्रंट ऑफ द टॉपिक बेटा फ्रंट में क्या लिखोगे दिस इज द टॉपिक ना यू वेंट टू नैनीताल इन एक्सट्रीम दिस इज द टॉपिक मैम Mam is starting. I am writing. What, beta? Mam, I am starting. I am also right. This the time was nine thirty. I see the Nanitals mountain. That that time. Yes, 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 beta. Write it. Write it. And after writing, click picture and send it. Okay. Ma'am, I cannot understand the meaning of nature gifts. Yes, ma'am. Ma'am, I cannot understand the meaning of nature's gift. nature's gift now nature has given us so many gifts yes we view we see so many beautiful things so snowfall is also one of those nature's gift yes snow does not fall everywhere does it fall on plains no it doesn't does it fall on desert no, areas no in hills and mountains mountain regions when we see a snow uh, when we see snowfall it is like a gift to the nature it is an experience we get to see such a wonderful experience and mom i can also say that and i have seen the i've seen seen the snowflakes what is snowflake and i was mom you don't know snowflakes snowflakes yes ma it is ma snowflakes but not snowflakes yes you can write yeah. ma'am can i write there are horse and i also sit in horse yes you can add that if you want you can add that okay ma'am Ma'am, I visit one time Nanital, but I not see the snowfall. Yes, even I have never seen. Cause ma'am, we ma all visited in. Ma'am, cause we all visited in. Ma'am, summers. Ma'am, cause in summer the the weather is pleasant. Yes, it is. The summers are cool. They are not cold. So what we are doing? 
We are writing a diary and Shirsh, beta, what time have you entered the class? Ma'am, just right now. Very bad, beta. Very bad. Now you will see the recording and then you will do your work. Or if you can do your work from here, you will do it from here. After twenty minutes, oh. you are entering the class. How huh? twenty-five minutes? No, ma'am. I was giving my sister food, and I, I was also eating. Okay, कोई बात नहीं अब आप recording देखना and you'll do your work. No, ma'am. You will. You can just tell me. I will. I will do it. You have to do diary entry. So, ma'am, we have With to write topic. about our journey. Yes, you are your experience. your journey or your visit to nenital your experience you were how surprised or how happy you were how you felt after seeing snow fall for the first time and how so diary we, entries so we also tell about the journey or we we no, have to tell about this experience when we reached just this experience of yours you have to tell okay ma'am and how you write how you begin writing you write down the day the date and the time in the beginning on the left hand side and how you begin writing dear diary and in the end you write your name after finishing the whole paragraph you write your name in the end excuse me ma'am yes ma'am what is the spelling of balcony b a l c o n y balcony so ma'am we will write date and dear diary day Date, time, three things. Day, date, and time. So, ma'am, first day, and ma'am, then date, and then time. Yes. Ma'am, what we have to write in time? Ma'am, it it the should time, be any time. Beta, be quiet, Risha. The time when you begin writing. What is the time right oh. now? You have to write that. Ma'am, like this. So, ma'am, Monday, thirty first January, twenty twenty two, four p.m. Dear diary. Yes. I want to share my experience to Nanital. Of Nanital. Like this. Yes. Of Nanital. Yes. Yes. Okay, Pratyaksh, like this. Well, in my di diary, the months went from Ma'am, like I am talking in my diary, I have written when we reach Nenital, so I have to write V or I. When I reached Nenital with my family, you can write that, or with my cousins, my relatives. When I reached Nenital, because with a diary is usually written in first person. Uh, 
मैम पहुंचने को इंग्लिश में क्या कहते हैं बेटा टू रीच Ma'am, can I talk about the tour? You can talk about what? Ma'am, like uh, I reach to the resort and then I take a uh, tour of resort and uh, room. Yes, Peter. Yes, you can talk. Ma'am, can I divide in two paragraphs? Yes, better. Yes, you can divide. Um, what is the meaning of sorry ma'am what is the spelling of exciting e x c i t i n g exciting ma'am e x c i t i n g yes ma'am n g exciting
So E X C I T I N G. Yes. I'm going to show how much I have written. How much? I have written. You want to show me? Yes, ma. Show. Good, very nice. Looks really nice. Mama, know that I have visited. This ice places many times, but I don't remember. Which is it in Himachal somewhere? No, ma'am. I have visited many places like ma'am Shimla, Nani. <coughs> ma'am, I have visited Shimla, Manali, but ma'am, I don't remember. I just said to my parents, please, please, please let us go to a place where there's snowfall. Okay. Okay. Yes, ma'am. Ma'am, I was small. I have been in the camps. Okay, very good. Yes. Ma'am, uh, uh, when uh, there was holidays, uh, so I uh, went in uh, Himachal Pradesh. So uh, in uh, there was summer holidays, so there was no snow. And uh, before coming school, I went in winters. At this snow place, and there was snowfall. Okay, 